guys so welcome back to my channel uh, right now I am currently on barren island my difficulty is level 2 and this video here is really to cover the different types of hunting insects or creatures on this particular island so now you're going to see a few things that are similar to a normal silver compared to barren, barren island so here we're going to see well the basic insects now these insects could range from level 1 straight up to level 15 but that's any normal silver. When you're on Barren Island these insects could actually range from level 1 to 17. Now this is just the normal insects here 17 or even 19. Now as you can see the creatures look similar some looks different so in this case here as you all know let's go back to basics that certain creatures will give certain types of rewards now if you look at the beetle here this is a level 10 beetle so you can see it gives like 60k sand um, you're likely to get some creature remains an insect egg and a few other items right now the enhancement resin on barren island you could redeem in the season store so basically where you find your season store is you go into your ant hole and um, you just go on one of your stores you go straight down you see season store pops up here so your resin is basically used to enhance your ant hill so like how you will upgrade in this case you're upgrading certain aspects of your ant hill just to benefit uh, barren island so if I come in here and I want to upgrade this it uses a certain amount of enhancement resin now if you go back to your season store you will also see the lost island fruit where you could use to redeem anything here so right now I really want an exotic shell so I'm going to purchase that exotic shell so you also get that from completing tasks even hunting different um, creatures so you will see the normal um, pango the pango is here as you all know each day will have a different category of ants today is the carrier and as we know once we battle our pango you will actually get your different types of rewards now your rewards are literally found right here in the events so once you're here you're going to check rewards you're going to see what you could collect and that's also in barren island um, another thing you will see it'll have level 35 lizards which we also known but it also have up to level 40 geckos so to find your geckos you go straight down only 35 is left out if you click it now I've already attacked you will see your different hunting rewards so if you take a note it actually has like 160 resin compared to a basically let's say we find a level 35 lizard so there are some similarities but more rewards as you can see right so you see 130 resin compared again to our gecko which is 160 so that's the geckos and we're going back to the insects now so if you click on the devil stick this is a level 18 and as you can see it has like 104 um, soil so this is 104 soil and let's say we go to a lower um, a lower creature that basically gives the same thing so let's see if we could find one all right you know what let's let's do this one instead since these two are like literally close to each other so we went through the beetle which is 60.9 now if it is i go on the airway it's a level 18 104 so that's a really nice thing now during this barren island experience you have like different events so this here so let's say i want to challenge this thing now this is really more beneficial if you want to rally it by your well attack it by yourself not much rally so let's say i want to invade now also note that you could even use season ants so usually we're able to unlock up the t10s in this game or in this area 
um, you actually get T11s. So you could even use your special ands because it's only given here in, um, in the season. And once the season is over, it disappears. So I could just, let's say I want to attack, it takes up no stamina. And that's the really cool thing. Unlike your geckos, um, it picks up the same amount of stamina as your lizard, which is like 10 units. Um, same thing too with your different insects, 10 units. So over here now, let's see. When I went here, this is my rewards, right? So this is my extra rewards. The first time I attack, the second one will be what I'm going to keep getting, right? So we did one attack. Let's go back. Let's attack again. There. And um, when you're on Barren Island, I will do another video as to how you obtain these special ants, right? Um, it's a really nice little process. You'll have to go through, so you have to be a little patient. So here we did another attack. And as you can see, this is the only rewards I get. Now, that's not the only rewards in this section. Now, if you click on top of your development, the Barren Land Hunter, you will see check rewards. So I actually could claim this, and this is my personal rewards, as you can see. Unlike my Alliance awards, as other people attack, you know, you basically get rewards too. You also have a certain number of times you can attack, which is like basically 15, I attack twice. And um, the Gecko, well, we went through the Gecko. So one other aspect or one other creature I would like to mention now, the hunter actually appears multiple times during the season, the gecko also. So my favorite is this little bee over here, as we can see. So I'm going to teleport here. Now this is my rewards there. And you get this throughout whatever hornet you attack. So they basically start at level 16 and it goes up to like 20, 21, right? I, I've only reached up to level 19 so if I attack this here right so I'm going to march I'm going to attack him let's see what's going to happen there we go he's dead now if you're like attacking a creature that's literally stronger than you you will get a notification as to hey this creature is stronger than you, do you want to continue attacking? And you could go ahead and try, or you could use a buff and try, or you could just find something that's lower. So here we go, um, my report. And this is what I got. So all these rewards are really, really nice. So let's say I want one of this. I could select any one of the following rewards. So to actually access my rewards, I go under rewards in the inventory and uh, well you can see here again with the red dot as to what I could do. Now let's say I want to occupy one. I could choose whichever category of resources I need to benefit, right? And just like certain creatures you get eggs and here we have like the season eggs. I will go into that another day, right? Since today is basically recovering hunting these different creatures. So Barren Island is really a nice experience. It takes a lot of teamwork. And I will say hunting these insects are really fun because of the different rewards. And believe it or not, it helps a lot when it comes to literally upgrading your hill. You know, so I hope you all will give Barren Island or even Lost Island a try because Lost Island also has like similar features of, of Barren Island, but um, higher difficulty, basically um, more rewards. So I hope you all will give it a try. I hope this video helps a lot and please come back again soon.